So, I just chopped him up and... Oh, <laughs> Tester is back! Hello! Hello, Tester. A long time no see. Sorry about the last time. I got really angry, you know? And then my friend came about the bed I lost. <laughs> you can't even imagine what I had to do. Anyway, it's in the past now. Let's not talk about it. Let's just continue testing. Agreed? There's your target, right in the corner. That fits perfectly. Please tell me you know how to- Hooray! I see you know the first rule of fashion. I know what you are thinking. That's the... wrong way. I'm not sure if I should tell you what to do here. You're going to ignore it. I'm glad you have at least a smidge of taste. Oh, what a beauty. Oh, quickly, to be honest, it wasn't that hard. Concentrate. Mmm. 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 Yeah. Oh. Oh. Mmm. Done. Here are your results. I'm watching. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mmm. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Done. Here are your results.
Okay, let's begin. Lesson three, domestic animals. Let's look at the picture. This is a cat. The cat is in the kitchen. Cats don't like water. Water makes cats wet. Where is the cat in the kitchen? That's right. The cat is on the table. The cat wants to leave the kitchen. Continue to the next picture. Page 17, exercise 3. Examine the picture. Where is the cat now? Yes, the cat is in the bedroom. Linda and Mary really like their black dresses and their amazing white cat. Let's go to the next exercise. Page 17, exercise 4. Imagine a situation. Linda and Mary received a package. Describe its contents using some of the words from previous exercises. Very good. Now, what are these objects for? You did very good. This concludes exercise four. Continue to the next exercise. Lesson three, domestic animals. Page 18, exercise five. Let's look at the picture. This is a dog. The dog is in the kitchen. What colour is the doggy? Very orange. Is she a good doggy? No, she is a bad doggy. Tonight she will sleep outside. Page 18, exercise 6. Listening. Listen carefully to a fragment from the book Elephant and the Balloon. The dog went out for a walk. The sun was high. The weather's dry. It was afternoon o'clock. The night came by really fast. The sun disappeared. The sky was all clear. The dog was having a blast. She was having the time of her life. But her loud cries, to her own demise, have awoken the master's wife. Now please answer the following questions. Did the doggy deserve to stay outside? Very good answer. She got what she deserved. Continue to the last exercise in this lesson. Page 19, exercise 7. Let's answer some questions together. A dog says, Woof! That's right. A cat says, Meow. Correct. What do cats think when they blankly stare at the wall and frantically meow at three in the morning as if there was something there, but there is nothing? Do they dream of big mansions of cardboard or do they see a ghost? Or maybe they realise that their feet are their hands and vice versa. Or possibly they contemplate one of their previous lives, counting all the slain wildlife. Do cats go to Valhalla? Or maybe they understand that they are just pets in our life, something to lighten the burden of eternal torture that is our existence. Or maybe they're just cats that want outside. This concludes this lesson. This is the end of side A. Please turn over to side B. Okay, let's begin. Lesson three, domestic animals. Let's look at the picture. This is a cat. The cat is in the kitchen. Cats don't like water. Water makes cats wet. Where is the cat in the kitchen? That's right. The cat is on the table. The cat wants to leave the kitchen. Let's say it together. The cat wants to leave the kitchen. 
once more. The cat wants to leave the kitchen. Cats like to jump. Cats always land on their feet. Repeat after me. Cats always land on their feet. Continue to the next picture. Page 17, exercise 3. Examine the picture. Where is the cat now? Yes, the cat is in the bedroom. Linda and Mary really like their black dresses and their amazing white cat. Let's go to the next exercise. Page 17, exercise 4. Imagine a situation. Linda and Mary received a package. Describe its contents using some of the words from previous exercises. You did very good. This concludes exercise four. Continue to the next exercise. Lesson three, domestic animals. Page 18, exercise five. Let's look at the picture. Let's say bye bye to the doggy together. Bye bye doggy. Page 18, exercise six. Listening. Listen carefully to a fragment from the book Elephant and the Balloon. The dog went out for a walk. The sun was high, the weather's dry. It was afternoon o'clock. The night came by really fast. The sun disappeared, the sky was all clear. The dog was having a blast. She was having the time of her life. She was jumping high, kissed the moon goodbye, and didn't disturb the master's wife. Now please answer the following questions. Was the doggy very good in this fragment? Very good. Continue to the last exercise in this lesson. Page 19, exercise 7. Let's answer some questions together. A dog says, Woof! That's right. A cat says, Meow! Correct. What do cats think when they blankly stare at the wall and frantically meow at three in the morning as if there was something there, but there is nothing? Do they dream of big mansions of cardboard? Or do they see a ghost? Or maybe they realise that their feet are their hands and vice versa. Or maybe they're just cats that want outside. This concludes this lesson. Here we go. Lesson three, domestic animals. Let's look at the picture. This is a cat. The cat is in the kitchen. What else is on the table? Correct. A sink 
and an empty glass are on the table. The cat wants to leave the kitchen. Continue to the next picture. Page 17, exercise 3. Let's count together how much hair cats lose. That's right. Cats lose a lot of hair. Linda and Mary really like their black dresses and their amazing white cat. Let's go to the next exercise. Page 17, exercise 4. Imagine a situation. Linda and Mary received a package. Describe its contents using some of the words from previous exercises. You did very good. This concludes exercise 4. Continue to the next exercise. Lesson 3. Domestic animals. Page 18, exercise 5. Let's look at the picture. Let's say bye-bye to the doggy together. Bye-bye, doggy. Page 18, exercise 6. Listening. Listen carefully to a fragment from the book Elephant and the Balloon. The dog went out for a walk. The sun was high. The weather's dry. It was afternoon o'clock. The night came by really fast. The sun disappeared. The sky was all clear. The dog was having a blast. She was having the time of her life. She was jumping high, kissed the moon goodbye, and didn't disturb the master's wife. Now please answer the following questions. Was the doggy very good in this fragment? Very good. Continue to the last exercise in this lesson. Page 19, exercise 7. Let's answer some questions together. A dog says, Woof! That's right. A cat says, Meow! Correct. What do cats think when they blankly stare at the wall and frantically meow at three in the morning as if there was something there, but there is nothing. Do they dream of big mansions of cardboard, or do they see a ghost? Or maybe they realise that their feet are their hands and vice versa. Or possibly they contemplate one of their previous lives, counting all the slain wildlife. Do cats go to Valhalla? Or maybe they understand that they are just pets in our life, something to lighten the burden of eternal torture that is our existence.
they're just dumb. This concludes this lesson. Here we go. Lesson three, domestic animals. Let's look at the picture. This is a cat. The cat is in the kitchen. What else is on the table? Correct. A sink and an empty glass are on the table. Continue to the next picture. Page 17, exercise three. Examine the picture. Where is the cat now? Yes, the cat is in the bedroom. Linda and Mary really like their black dresses and their amazing white cat. Let's go to the next exercise. Page 17, exercise four. Imagine a situation. Linda and Mary received a package. Describe its contents using some of the words from previous exercises. You did very well. This concludes exercise four. Continue to the next exercise. Lesson three, domestic animals. Page 18, exercise five. Let's look at the picture. This is a dog. Is she a good doggy? No, she is a bad doggy. Tonight she will sleep outside. Page 18, exercise six. Listening. Listen carefully to a fragment from the book Elephant and the Balloon. The dog went out for a walk. The sun was high. The weather's dry. It was afternoon o'clock. The night came by really fast. The sun disappeared. The sky was all clear. The dog was having a blast. She was having the time of her life. But her loud cries, to her own demise, have awoken the master's wife. Now please answer the following questions. Did the doggy deserve to stay outside? Very good answer. She got what she deserved. Continue to the last exercise in this lesson. Page 19, exercise 7. Let's answer some questions together. A dog says, Woof! That's right. A cat says, Meow! Correct. Are all cats dumb? No, just this one. This concludes this lesson. What was that? What the hell was that? I won't accept it. And remember that cake? Well, forget it. Because for a performance like that, life has prepared you another gift. Boom! Lemons all over your life! I think I'll have to enable the duck after all. No, no, that could ruin the game. Ooh, this one is tricky. You want to be very careful. Oh, that's the best gift I could get. Well, except for, would you suggest the game to your friends? Mm. 
Oh, this is my favorite puzzle. Well, this and uh, cats, cats. Nice. Yeah, just nice. No idea what else to add. Charge! Okay, sorry. Take it out before it overheats. Take it out! There is your fully charged phone. Quick, take a picture. Perfect! Did you know that standing in line weeks ahead is like pre-ordering video games? Let's wait together. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. You're good. As my grandpa always said, Get off my lawn! You were born to do this. Solve this good and I'll show you my code bloopers. It wasn't that hard. Go, go, go! Catch it? Good doggy! Hey, okay. Thank you. You can lose everything. Of course. Ooh, art. Wow, you know how to. That was rude. Looks correct. You just saved someone's life. Oh, what a rush. Now, on to results. Let's begin. It's easy. Good one. Nice! Faster, faster! Saved! Literally. Uh, pull a little. You need to answer. Like I taught you. Phew, that was fast. Let's see your results. What could be a better way to end Fast Pack than a race? Win the race, get the cup. So get ready to click. Three, two, one, go! Click, 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 click! Oh no, they are winning. You're clicking way too slow. Here, I'll help you. Get ready, go! Click, 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 click! No, you're still too slow. You gotta go fast. Just take this. Turbo snail! And once again, go! Click, 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 click! No, that's the wrong way, dummy! Ugh, 
you know what? It's my game, so I'll cheat a little. There. You can't lose now. And start clicking! Ah! No! Wrong way again! Ah! Okay, just... just take it and leave. You took all the fun out of it. Go, go, go! Responsible storage. Conditions met. Don't touch it. You need to answer. That was bad. Uh-oh. Like I taught you. You can lose everything! Fast food! Mm, yum! Make haste! Solve it! Here it comes! Don't be rude! Good doggy! Faster, faster! Good one! And you are done! Now, let's check how you did. Think. Something gonna break. Now it's dirty. to answer. That was rude. Go, go, go! Think. You misclicked. Let's begin.
Make haste! Going up. <laughs> you can lose everything. Of course. Let's start simple with a driving test. Go faster! It's good I don't include all the audio in my game, because they are not pleased. Kids can handle this. They handle it all the time. Can you? So, was it hard? Did you have fun? I thought so. Don't sit in the back. Those seats are for the cool kids. And homeless people. An even better solution would be to wait for the next bus. This level requires some loading. That was a clean solution. Here are some pics of one of my favorite cups. Oh, thank God you didn't check all my photos, messages, videos, appointments, recordings, and dating gaps. Hmm. We all have a friend that would. 
Let's see how you behave in a shop. Your task is to buy a shirt. I would have spent like an hour choosing. Or maybe it's just me, because I care how I look. Hmm. Just sit your guy and enjoy the movie. And don't forget to step on everyone's feet while you walk to your seat. I'm imagining it's your thing. You are in a cinema. Don't you dare call someone. Hmm, you know how to mute your phone in the cinema. I hope it's not just because you want to get a good cup. Here is your cup. But aren't you a little tired of getting basic golden cups? Kapow! We have the technology! You can augment it! You can make it better, stronger, shinier! So much better! No, something else needs to be snapped before it. Marvelous! Magnificent! Okay, last part. Ta-da! Glorious! Robocop is on duty. Now everybody will see them. Looking good! Here, take this one. Just don't forget to give it back. Good, now you can move on. Thanks. Smart move. Let's see for how long you will extend your Christmas. And next time Christmas will feel special, cause you didn't celebrate it for half a year. Now focus, it may look hot. Nice! Yeah, just nice. No idea what else to add. I bet this bill is more than you earn in a month by doing dishes.
Or you could just use a credit card as any adult would. Oh, yeah, adult. Sorry. <laughs> oh, and thanks for the tip. Let's play football. And no, not soccer. We literally have a foot and a ball. Now you can tell your mama you did some sports today, even if it wasn't esports. As my grandpa always said, be good and you won't get a beating. As my grandpa always said, you're goddamn right. Now spread it gently. Up and down. Up and down. You done there? Now throw away that empty jar. Oh, that's the best gift I could get. Well, except for, would you suggest the game to your friends? Mm. Do I really need to explain this perfect fit? Two in a row. A game inside the game? Boom, gameception. Complete to get a cup. Good luck. One in, three to go. Two more. And now the last one. Done. Now look, look, something is... <clears throat> A holy grail. Brace yourself, Christmas is coming. Come on, what's the hold up? Just place it on the floor straight. And that's how you succeed in life, by doing good deeds in a video game? Hmm, uh, forget it. Make me a sandwich, but no pickles. game so a kid in the park got his balloon stuck in a tree what will you do no wait wrong question oh that's the best gift I could get well except for would you suggest the game to your friends mm. be glad you don't need a steering wheel controller for this puzzle
Look at you, playing dress-up games. No, no, I'm not judging. <laughs> not at all. Close your eyes and think about your credit card's pin number really hard. Got it? And now enter any four-digit number. Wait, how did you... That's actually my password on it! Whoops! Almost said where! <laughs> Here are some last wise words. Give a man a cup and he'll be happy for a minute. Teach a man to cup and he'll be happy for a lifetime. Basically it's a uh, fishing. That's not your cup. You need to go deeper. Are we there yet? Will you please avoid it? It's not that hard. Should I do it for you? Hopeless. There it is! Snap it! And here comes your last good reward of the game! Or is it? Yes, it is. Don't go treasure fishing anymore. You've got them all! Now go and become the very best, a Jigsaw Master!
20 jigsaw pieces and it only took you this long to solve? Okay, this one just came in for you. Assembly required, batches not included. And be sure not to leave any extra pieces. 